What is up, you CISSP wannabes? Welcome to the CISSP question of the day, where each day I'm going to give you not one, but two CISSP practice questions for you to ponder and think about. Uh, I'm Colin Weaver. Let's go ahead and get this started. Question number one. Which of the following operates at layer two of the OSI model? If you need to, go ahead and click pause, decide what the answer is, and then click play, and we'll talk it through. All right, looking at those answer choices, you got the trusted platform module, a TPM. Uh, no, that's some junk integrated into your motherboard, so it's a physical device that messes around with cryptographic keys. Um, IP headers, that's all about some layer three for going in and doing that. The um, uh, Systems Development Lifecycle, SDLC, absolutely nothing to do with the OSI model. Uh, logical link control, ding, 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 that's all about layer two of the OSI model. Um, for going in and looking at how Ethernet is structured <clears throat> in terms of the media access control and logical link control components of Ethernet. Uh, modulation, that's all about layer one. And the final one that's on there is flow labels. That's actually some stuff built into the IPv6 header. So that would also be layer three. Okay, cool. So the best answer here, logical link control. Question number two. COBIT, Control Objectives for Information and Related Technology, is uh, comprised of four broad domains and 34 different processes. COBIT's purpose is to provide a framework for IT management and IT governance. Of the choices that are listed here, which of the four comprise the four broad domains of COBIT? Go ahead and click pause, think about what the answers are, then click play and we can break it down. Okay. COBIT's 34 processes are broken into four broad groups. They are plan and organize, acquire and implement, deliver and support, monitor and evaluate. All right, that's it for today. So we had two questions today. One was on uh, which of different protocols or things operated at which layer of the OSI model. Uh, we saw that it was logical and control. And we also had just a very general question about the overall structure of COBIT, Control Objectives for Information and Related Technology, and uh, that'll do it. If these questions were helpful for you, please, please, please go ahead and click on that like button. If you want questions every single day as you continue to prep for your CISSP exam, click on that subscribe button, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, and as always, links that relate to the stuff that we talked about, you'll find in the comments down below.